Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Building with Sausage. This is Mythical Sausage here. Hi, what's up everybody? How are you doing today? Today we're going to be doing something cool, another in our series here. Our little starter series is going to be pretty cool. It's a little starter gazebo and it's amazing. And you can also double it and use it as just a base for a beacon, which is pretty cool. And I'm just going to show you right now. And again, like we always say, if you guys want to catch any one of the starter builds we got going down this road, little silo, little fountain, we got a bridge, we got so many down the row put a link in the description with the playlist just check them all out they're all cool and we're using the b-dubs texture pack for vanilla just in case you want to know put a link down there too if you want to download it it's pretty sexy but let's go baby let's do a little flip job and i'll show you our gazebo now bam bam look at this so cool so cool i love it let's do a little spin job I like it. It's very sexy. I don't think I've ever done this on a, one of our Let's Builds. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. It's pretty sexy. And I'll show you how we did it right now. Boom. Right here. Super simple. Let's go take a little aerial view. So you can take out. Just just let it in. Let, breathe it in. This is so simple. So simple. Look at this little circle. So all you got to do to make this circle right here. We're going to do a five liner right there. A little gap right here with one. Another fiver. A little one. Five. One. Five. One. Five. One. And here. Pretty simple. Pause the screen. Let's go. And now this is the center, just in case you know you're freaking out. This is the center right there. Look at the center. Center job. Boom. Okay. Now let's do it. Oh, it looks like a little titty. Oh, let's get it out. Okay. Now, <laughs> so let's start it out. First off, this is what we're gonna do. Uh, let's actually right here. We're gonna go. Let's start here. Make it simple. Let's lift it off the ground. Let's go one all the way around, just so you can see it. One off the ground, just so you can actually see it in 3D. Not in there, just hanging out deep in the ground. Okay, right there, boom. Okay, now, let's work on some sexy stuff. We're gonna work on a stairwell to get up to the top. Now, before we do that, let's actually, right here, let's start on this corner, right here. Let's just go up one. Okay, that's technically one, so that's two, a three, a four. Okay, let's go up by four. Boom, boom, boom. All right, now just do it on this side, and then we're gonna do a mirror job in a second, all right? So now, go up again, buy one more here. All right, and now on top of this one, we're gonna go ahead and put some of the spruce wood right here. Perfect, okay? Now, check this out. Now, right here, let's cover this up. One more, and one down here. So that's gonna be your stair going up to the top. Really simple. Now, covering this stair now with some actual spruce stair, we're gonna go up right here, here, and here. Perfect, look at that little stairwell going up, all right? So we got the stone brick, and now we got the little stair with a nice little, uh, this is just so you can get in, all right? Okay, ready. Now, let's grab our chisel stone bricks and put it one here, right next to the stair, here. One next to the stair, here, all right? And now do, actually, one more. Let's get rid of you, put it in here. Get rid of that guy, put it in here. So it looks very sexy. Now let's run it down again the same way, and then we're gonna see a little gap right here in the middle, right there, okay? Cool. Now, on top of these uh, sexes, we're going to go ahead and cover them up with a smooth stone slab all the way around till we get to there. Look how nice. That's a little stairwell. Underneath these guys, put a slab and a slab just on the bottom part of those chisels. Right here, do it again. Boom and a boom. Cool. Look at that. How nice. All right. Now, we're going to do this four more times. Well, three more times. I can't count. So let me do it in all the corners and I'll bring you guys back in a second once we finish it. All right. Here we go. All right, now we did it. Everything is mirrored right there. Look at this little stairway to get it up to the top of the beautiful gazebo. Now, next up, this is what we're going to do. Now, let's grab this cute little stone, and we're going to go up. All right, let's count it. Let's go one. That's one already, okay? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Is it eight? I think it's eight. Let's make sure. Yep. It's eight. Okay. Now, let's go up eight on all of these. So, that's eight. Let's go to one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Do it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And last one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think that's fine. Okay, good. <laughs> all right, cool. Now, another thing we want to do is... Oh, I didn't finish this. What's wrong with you, Sausage? You don't pay no attention to what you're doing. There we go. That's fine. Now, it's good. <laughs> let's make sure everything's fine. Let's go around. Yeah, okay. We're good. All right. Now, what was that? Stupid. Got it. Okay, now... Next up, we're gonna grab these stairs. Down here, we're just gonna run, put a little ring around the rosy on those little boys. Now, all this gonna go around with stairs. All this gonna go around with stairs, just like that. Make a nice little uh, pillar looking like that. And then one more. We did that. Okay, fine. We got that going. Now, next up, right here, we're gonna do upside down stair, upside down stair, upside down, upside down. Let's do upside down stairs on every corner of these uh, that we got up by eight, these little pillars, all right? We're gonna go all the way around, do it together. Very nice, very lovely. That was incorrect, but that was fine. I fixed it. There it is. <laughs> All right, now we got that going. Perfect. 
Now, next up, let's do this. Let's actually, before we go on to the next one, let's work on this little bottom base we got going. Real simple, real simple. Now, over here, hold on. I think it was simple, but I forgot what it was. Let's go. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> All right, down here, let's just do, put these chisels, because why not? Even though you won't be able to see them, it's cool to remember they're there. Uh, now, <laughs> on the corners right here, let's just with stair, 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 stair stair and a stair okay and now over here let's just go ahead and put what did we do <laughs> oh, okay that's simple that's simple mode now another chisel right here 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 over on these corners right here we're gonna go ahead and put a uh, spruce line spruce line another spruce line and then over here we're gonna do some stairs of cobble baby we're gonna get the cobble we're gonna go ahead and put this right here like this watch this boom 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 Another one, boom, boom, a boom. Another one, yeah, okay. Now, under this, we're gonna do, go ahead and just gonna waste uh, materials, that's fine. Chisels all the way till we get to here. One more here. Grab your little spruce. We're gonna put the spruce here, 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 and here. And then right here, this is where the beacon's gonna go. So just so you can know where it's gonna go, we're gonna put the beacon right over here. All right, and then on top, you can put, put a glass, uh, put anything, let's put some red glass. Uh, and you you know remember every glass you use the beacon will be that color so you can be changing it up But for now, I'm gonna put a little red one. All right, cool now next up We got the base all done ready to go now next up We're gonna work on the top portion of that beautiful roof now for this We're just gonna get our spruce and do this. Let's just run a line like this We're gonna modify it in a little bit, but for now just so you can make it easy on yourself Let's just run it down like so we're gonna do a slight modification in the middle just to give it a little bit more Definition and detail, but just so you can get a nice flow outline going let's just do it like so we're gonna go all the way around we're gonna modify it in a second let's do it going all the way around make a little ring around here make a little nice ring around here. oh almost done boom perfect okay now next up we're gonna do one thing here on this corner just so you can make it look sexy grab your chisel one more time put one here 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 and here here and here okay cool now we're gonna go this one you don't need to put anything it doesn't matter you don't need it now let's go one more time do another little ring we're gonna do another layer of this roof going all the way around like so really simple this is easy mode okay this is what makes it look sexy in a second when i do the little transformation the little modification in the center of the roof but for now just do that all right cool now watch this next up what we're gonna do is right here let's do one more chisel right boom right here 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 and here okay that's that little extra piece you see right there. Now, we're going to go up with your regular stone brick. We're going to go up by one and a two. One and a two. One and a two. One and a two. Okay, cool. Now, we got that. Let's check it out. We're looking at both sides. Yeah, it's looking nice. Looking lovely. All right, next up. This is what we're going to do. Grab your upside down stair. We're going to grab it. Grab it. We're going to grab it and put it here. Right here on the corners. Just the corners. Not the inside part. Just these corners like so. Boom. Okay. See that? That's very cute. Very lovely. One more thing we're going to do with on the inside part right here. We're going to grab a slab and we're going to run a slab like so. Right. Oh, sorry. Not there. But one up like that. One up. See it? It's going one up right on the bottom part of this brick. So we're going to go right there all the way around. And then when you go outside, it looks like that. So it looks like almost like the roof is continuing its slope to the top. All right. Cool. Now, next up, we're going to grab that uh, stair. And we're going to run that same pattern. And we're going to do a little modification just at the end. But for now, let's just close it off. Just so you can see it. Get the idea how the roof is being uh, twisted around and circled around this little love little base and these little pillar bases. Uh, almost in there. Okay. Now, next up. Uh, let's actually well I'm fouling let's raise this up by one more just so you could be easier to place the blocks You don't need to but it actually helps out. You'll see why now because now watch this boom base We got a little base to it and we're gonna go around one more time Like so one more time. Oh, no, I'm placing wrong and go all the way around this part's easy Just gonna circle it around boom 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 now on this one. We're gonna do upside down stair upside down upside down upside down and then we're going to go ahead and do one more ring all the way around with this roof. And we're going to stop right there. And boom. Ow, no. There. Now here, boom, your beam of light just goes all the way up from the beacon. Look how sexy. Now, this is pretty much, you're pretty much done. But this is where we're going to do the little modification to get those nice little details on the roof. All right? Watch this. Now, right in the center, get rid of this, this, this. We're going to do upside down stair here, here, and here. Very simple. Slab. That's all there is to it. 
I'm gonna do one more here. Get rid of this, this, this. I'm gonna do upside down stair here. Oh no, not there. Here, here, and then one more right there. Okay, cool. Now I'm gonna do this on all the sides, and we'll be right back in a second. All right, everybody, check this out. We did all the roofs. Look at this, how nice. Everything looks nice and sexy. Look at that. All right, now, next thing we want to do, just to give it a little bit more detail, let's come on the inside here with me. Come inside with me. Now, to give it just a little bit more, just on the inside, all right? This is what we're going to do. See this little gap space we got right here in between all these chisels right here? I want to get a full block, all right? Just get a full block, put it right here. Put it right there, there, there. So we got all that going. Now, we're going to do a little bit of detail. Watch this. We're going to grab a cobble wall. We're going to go down here where this chisel's at, and we're going to meet this cobble wall all the way to that block that we just placed. So let's do it on all the corners. It's just cool. It just gives a little bit more to look at, a little bit more detail than hair to anybody. Now, we're going to grab that, go all the way down. We got one more to go, and boom. So we got that little bit of detail. Now, one more extra piece of detail. Grab your stone slabs. And right here on the top part of this block, it's going to run a line just to give it just a little more it's going all the way around like so and then one more like no now what's all this well, like that perfect <laughs> so we got that nice little cubby hole looking thing right here now for this part i'm just going to go ahead and put glowstone just to give it some glow some little shininess and this is our pretty much our lighting that you can check out from all the way around here now for these little gaps that we have space there uh we're just going to close these off so to close these off i'm just going to get uh, just a spruce plank and put it all the way around like so leaving that like this you can leave it open like that with the glowstone but i want to close it off because i don't want to see exposed glowstone so i'm going to cover this up with our little trap door and with the beat of texture pack look at that trap door so nice now that is pretty much it for details up here you can if you want to you can add more stuff you can put trap doors on these corners which is which is not too bad actually you can even put trap doors in here just to give it a different texture so when you look up you got that going all right look at that let's see very cool so you got that nice little pattern and then deep make sure to leave this open if you want you can put the glass here um so change the color or you can change the glass color down here either way up here it's going to leave it open okay so the little beam can just go crazy up in there uh in here if you want you can actually throw some more trapdoor just to give it extra detail and change the texture a little bit so it still keeps that spruce but adds a little more texture to it and that is all we got today look at that let's take a quick little spin what do you guys think of this little gazebo? You know, we usually I, we check up the other one, the original one, but, you know, this not interior work or anything. This is pretty much exactly mirrored from one end to the other. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. This is pretty cool. Dual gazebo action. <laughs> All right, guys. I am out of here. Hopefully you liked it. And I will see you very, very shortly. Again, if you guys got any ideas of any other builds you want me to try, just let me know in the bottom in the comment section. I might try it out in one of these upcoming episodes. we got a couple other builds coming up that are going to be also very sexy. So make sure you check those out too. But I'm out of here. And, guys, you know what? I'll catch you on the next episode of Building with Sauces. Goodbye, everybody. Have a beautiful day. Gazebos. Yay.